We're coming to you live from Tokyo, Japan at the world famous Krokyo Dome. You know, world famous doesn't mean as much as it used to since most of the world is a charred wasteland, but you get the meaning. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Brain Washington Cadavers battle, the Tokyo Terminators. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If the sound of a torn Achilles followed by laughter and taunting brings a smile to your face, you are tuned to the right place. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow and the MFL crew is coming to you live on game day. Bricks, any uh, thoughts on today's game? Um, I thought I had one, but uh, I think I might have forgotten it. All I remember, uh, I forgot who's playing today. Careful what you ask for, Grim. And it's first and ten. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. They run it for a yard. And four. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite, Dave, because he's the one who just got wiped out. And it's first and ten. Second down and a lot. And he rumbles for nine on that play. Third down and three. Man, guys like a freight train. Nice pick up there for a first down. And it's first and ten. He picks up eight yards on that pass. Second down and two. This one's going to be tough. I hope he has a good enough leg for this one. I saw him trying one on before the game. He looked okay, I think. Not my type, though. A little too mute. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. with the brutal hit.
and it's first and ten. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down in a mile. And that is a big game. You know the defense wants some payback after that. Second down and five. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. First and two. point attempt it goes right through yeah like a double stuff burrito from taco hell here comes the kickoff let's see if the defense can hold them he's gonna be able to run this one back i wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill First and ten. And this guy is supercharged with electricity. And if you can jump over those mines or steer clear of them. Second down and more than the QB would like. Stupid, maybe? I guess we'll decide after we see how this goes. But probably stupid. Kaboom! And the quarterback unleashes a sonic blast against the defense, knocking everyone down but his receiver. He knocked them right on their asses! <laughs> the defense wasn't ready for that at all, Bricks. The offense converts on four. And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. I know, I hate those zebra men. And we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. Oh, that was a snooze fest. And it looks like the... And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. Sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you 
took a lot of shots like that over here. And Thunder was killed, so now they'll need to find another player on the bench to punt from here on out. Yeah, who gives a crap about punters anyway? Punters' moms? Wives? Kids? Uh, but that's about it. And it's first and ten. Defenders are scared of this guy, Bricks, and they have every right to be. Yeah, he's a murderer! And it's first and ten. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done! And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. My turn out the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Second and three. Pounding the ball right up the gut, and you'll tire these guys out. First down. And it's first and ten. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole up here. Talking to you. Normally that would be a first down, but he had a whole lot of ground to make up. And that'll bring up third down and in inches. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. With no punters left, the coach sends out the guy who probably regrets telling everyone he could punt at the combine. A dud of a punt. I don't know why I expected more, but strangely I did. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburner. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. Nice run for five yards. Second down and five. First and ten. You know what they say? Sometimes anymore, Bricks. My daddy used to cut our hair with us. That was the first time I lost my ear. The ear fairy gave me a quarter for it, though, and that was a lot for an ear back then. Let me tell you.
know, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And it's first and ten. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. You know, a lot of guys talk about stepping up their game, Bricks. He just stepped up and blew up. <laughs> He's got a lot of guts, doesn't he? And you can see the grounds crew cleaning him up now. Hot potato gets him every time. And it's first and ten. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. And it's first and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Either way, they're going for two. <laughs> when you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. And he finds his target for two! Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? It's too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. Sound the bones snapping and cracking. I mean, when they're not young. Under two minutes of timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, with the 
brutal hit. They use their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A uh, bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point. And drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's the quarterback burns his last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. They get ready for the kick. This isn't a gimme. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. First and ten. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where are we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? Uh, we're going to go to a striptease show. Where are we going? Hey, why don't you settle down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. You want to do some fun on your time? They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Second down in a mile. And he picks up about six on the play. Third down and the punter is warming up. That's a killer. It was right there and then he dropped it. Ah. Oh. Scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. You know, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Nice punt. Should move them back nicely. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And it's first and ten. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. Second down and seven. And he puts 
works his way out and a hard run there picks up the first down and it's first and ten Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Second down and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. Third down and six. And that pass is good for about five yards. When your punter dies, it's next mutant up. Hopefully they have someone who can come off the bench and boot a good one. Ouch! Not good! Look like a, he just let that one drop and played safe, and the defense says we'll take it. And it's first and ten. And I'm not sure who he was throwing to on that play. Second down and ten. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? They might consider calling a kill the ref play. Just saying. Second down and a lot. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. <laughs> Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. This is your brain, and this is your brain on berserker drugs. Is that is that guy's brain getting crushed out of his helmet? If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks! And the quarterback drills one in for the first down! And it's first and ten. Boom! Dead and down! He just sent a message with that hit. The message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, going in circles. And that'll be second down and four. lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that one 
one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. First down and three. for one when you could go for two. It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, he's talking about points. And he makes the grab and adds two points to their score. Teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. They've called a zap attack. The ball carrier. Oh, he was hitting mid hurdle and fumbles the ball. The defense comes up with the ball. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. You know, you have to wonder if the original creators of the Doomsday AI programmed them to dance as a way to mock us as they took over, or if they taught themselves in the irradiated ruins of the old world. <laughs> Either way, enjoy. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. That's the end of the third quarter. And look, folks, help me honest. I don't see a chance in hell here. It might be time to change the channel. I think Heidi's playing on Superstation WKRP. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Fritz's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she he dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. That ball was almost intercepted. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. He had it for a second there. With all the punters dead, they send a guy out who punted once when he was six, so this probably won't go well. And to no one's surprise, he blows that punt. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. Crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. And then catch will give them a first down. And it's first and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And 
and it's first and ten. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. First down and one. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stumpsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. First down. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. If he had getting killed by a chainsaw before he could see his buddy, he He's at the 30. They're getting on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. We got a saw buck riding on this asshole. And it's first and ten. Mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. Oh, 
The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. There was a big explosion, and then everyone left disappointed. What do you mean, everyone? The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? You can't keep a good mutant down. First down! Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take... I'm not saying the rap has been bribed, but he drove out of the field in a brand new hearse. <laughs> Second down and long... Offense says it's time to put the rap out of his misery. Now this guy had a lot of integrity. If he took a bribe, he blew the whistle. He put his money where his mouth was. Oh, yeah! He now his mouth is where his foot was! On the ground! The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up, too? Grim, can I kill him? They pick up a nice chunk of yards on that pass play. Third down and long. And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. Third down and the punter is warming up. Wow! The quarterback just threw a sonic blast to his receiver. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. First and eight, and they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Really? The clock? The clock, Grim? I can smash a clock. That's not a great enemy. We're not talking about waking up at the crack of noon. We're talking about the MFL, you moron. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. <laughs> Man, those bones can boogie. The lack of muscle, fat, organs, and skin really makes it easy for him to dance. <laughs> Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called... It's good! <laughs> They'll be going onside here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. Usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck. Which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. First down and seven. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Touchdown!
Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. And it's first and ten. They're taking what the defense has given them. That's a four-yard gain on the reception. Hey. Less than a white for the headache. The Tokyo Terminators win the game today. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. How was it? Scrambles tomato soup. Wounds. Mm -mm, good. The MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Yeah, right. Putting three words together for this guy is like you doing a Rubik's Cube. What's a Rubik's Cube? Moving on. Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.